So, eighth grade year, I came out to play baseball for North Christian, and I knew who Ethan was because I've been going to school for a while, but I didn't know him, know him. I had a lot of classes. But come out on the baseball field and, um, you know, talk to him because he was one of the eighth graders and he was a stud and I was awful. <laughs> so, um, you know, and the start of like a relationship was there. And then we carried over into freshman and like uh, tried out for varsity and we both played. And me and him got a lot closer. And as the years went on, uh, there, a relationship just grew on that. And, you know, now he's like my brother and, you know, I have another family because of this guy, you know, because they've just been accepting of me. And, um, you know, and I guess I can thank baseball for that, but really it's, uh, God really just like put us together because we, you know, we build off of each other. And, uh, oh, was it 10th grade year? Yeah, 10th grade year, he, he came up to me and said, uh, I think I'm gonna be done with baseball after this year. And I was like, you know, I love baseball a lot and he does too. And I was a lot worse than you and I still wanted to play forever. <laughs> and I told him, I'm like, you know, I said, dude, you gotta remember, you're gonna look back on these days and you may regret it now because you had a bad game, but you're never gonna regret it when you're 60 and chilling in a recliner and you're retired. Because you're gonna remember those days as glory days. And, you know, you're gonna look back and you're just gonna remember like those are the guys. And you know, sometimes when you're out here playing under the lights, you feel like you might as well be in Fenway Park or Yankee Stadium or Camden North because it doesn't get much better than that. Um, Ethan taught me how to you know experience that aspect of the game because I'd get down on myself and he'd tell me how to enjoy baseball even when you were really low in it, you know? And, um, you know, and I, I went to build up on top of him, and now he's an amazing ball player, you know? Gets the ball hard, he's an amazing infielder, and he can throw some nasty pitches from the submarine. <laughs> yeah. And uh, I'm happy to call him a, you know, a teammate, uh, a classmate, even though I reclassified, which is dumb, but, you know? <laughs> so, you know He's, he's going on to do great things, you know, and uh, we've learned how to push each other even in school and outside of that. And uh, I'm not happy to call him one of my brothers, you know, and I'm excited to see where, you know, our relationship carries on beyond, you know, he's going to go on to college, I'm going to stay here in high school. But, uh, you know, I'm excited to see where it goes. He's, he's really an awesome dude. So. Yep. Yeah.